he'll miss a grab and then he'll go for another grab. Or like he'll miss uh, an up smash and then he'll go for another up smash. So if you get too predictable, you can get punished. Mm -hmm. Like super, super hard, especially as Mewtwo. So, let's see if uh, Ixus is adaptability. Yeah, there's definitely a different kind of matchup. Sonic Mewtwo is a strange one. Uh, Sonic obviously has a speed factor. I mean, mm -hmm. That's the easy one. Um, Mewtwo can kind of wall him out with like grounded side B sometimes when he like spin dashes at you. You can just kind of flip him up and then turn it into a, your own little mini combo. Mm -hmm. uh, the fair is good. The bear extends for both characters. So like raw back air is critical in this matchup overall for both characters. But Sonic can also just spin dash back air. So that's huge advantage. Also, the up air for Sonic can suck Mewtwo up really easily and relate to like double up air combos. Mm -hmm. Back throw, not quite yet. Someone's got to be careful of that back throw, though. Um, Mewtwo okay. super light. I know that's that's dumb to say because like, oh, you got to be really high percentage with Sonic to kill with back throw. Yeah, we're on battlefield, and he didn't have rage, and I think that might have killed on like Smashville or Town City. Your Town City, like it, it's Mewtwo is light enough to where that will punish. Mm -hmm. I think if um, Goes like here. if Ixus just kind of just like waits it out, have Zone uh, kind of like approach him, I think it's gonna be very harder. It's, it's gonna be harder for Zone to try to get in there. That's true. It's also just very difficult to grab Sonic. Like it is a general rule of thumb, grabbing a Sonic player is hard to do. And since Mewtwo is one of the best kill throws in the game with his up throw, um, that's an unfortunate tool that gets taken away. Oh, wow! Whoa. Wow! And it didn't even kill! Look how much you have to do to grab Sonic. Oh, oh catching him with the Shadow Ball. Oh, the air dodge, actually. Yeah, he was, he was short hopping a little too much and just kind of throwing out aerials, expecting the Mewtwo approach. The one thing I really like about Mewtwo is when he's like, tossing out the Shadow Ball, he does this kind of like wind up and then toss it. So it looks like Mewtwo, like within that like few frames, it looks like Mewtwo's gonna like do something else that isn't Shadow Ball. Like maybe like his his forward air. You know, maybe if he just jumps and just throws it, but like because he tossed it out, I think that's why X wanted to air dodge as we threw out his empty hops. And because of how big the Shadow Ball is. It also it. fades a little bit back as it's moving. Um, so like it'll move forward like what would be the equivalent to like let's say five units, and then it'll come backwards a little like a unit. So it like hovers there almost a little bit. Barely missed the spring there. Zone getting a little bit of a lead here. And Max Rage Mewtwo, we talk about how scary Max, Max Rage Bayo is. Uh, Max Rage Mewtwo will kill you with, like, one good combo. Back going to kill, though, instantly. Oh. <laughs> oh, Mewtwo, you're so light. Oh, you can't catch feet like that. It's like a combination of Mewtwo being so, so light and that move just being so damn powerful. Alright, zone air dodges through against the up air. Oh, oh Ixus got caught! My. That's gonna be the game. Uh, zone's gonna go up one nothing. Cancel. He, he canceled Shadow Ball just to toss it. He just did. to chuck it. Because I was gonna force Ixus to be either in shield or drop. And that's probably what have hit. Yeah, Yeah, and if Ixus' shield is low enough in that situation too, that can poke through. Mm, oh yeah. Happens all the time. That mm. thing, the encompassing hitbox on that thing is enormous if you're on the platform below you, that's just a place you don't want to be. And Zone baited it all the way with the, the oh, Shadow Ball yeah. charges, like, oh yeah, this platform's totally safe, come here, have a seat. <laughs> nah, shouldn't have done that. So now we're gonna go to FD. Um, great stage for Sonic. Um, oh, for sure. he can run so fast, and he can't get caught on platforms like he did last game. There's um, nowhere to run. Well, there's nowhere to run for Zone. That's true, there's everywhere to run. For Sonic, for Sonic. oh, for sure. This is Playground. All right, guess Nair and a dash attack. And... Right. Oh, wow, he just went for it. He's like, all right, if you're going to make me sit here for 10 seconds, I'm going to use this thing. Nice wow. little combo there. Going for the Paralyzer into the, on the Spin Dash. One thing I'm noticing that Zone, Zone's just really good at doing is just he's playing so calm. He's playing so calm, collected. I'm even, like, looking over, and granted, he's doing, like, typical, like, gaming, like, head bobs and stuff like that, but for the most part, like, even in his play. There it is, that Shadow Ball, got that little, like, trail hitbox. Caught Sonic right in the back of the spikes. And it killed him. So fat, so slow moving. Very hard for people to even try to predict, uh... Just predict it in general. 
But yeah, like like I said, Zone playing extremely calm. He's not trying to do anything, but ooh. There it misses, but it would have been a really juicy combo. Nix is showing that he's got back airs of his own. Yeah, well, Nix has uh, got to make something happen here. Does New Jersey have a good Sonic? I'm trying to think, like, my, my brain's a little bit fried, but, like, he knows this matchup. Like, he's been doing some crazy possum tricks. Either that or he's just doing normal YouTube stuff that's just kind of working for him. Yeah, that could be. He could just be on a roll today. But from somewhere, he has Sonic experience. Oh, the Nair pushed away the up smash that would have taken Zone's stock. Zone looked to st charge down smash. He has got some wacky options. Another fair. The Ix Ixus just cannot take the stock right now. The Sonic they have isn't... Oh, that'll take the Sonic. The Sonic they have is the top top 8, or top 10, but it's definitely like up there. Yeah, so New Jersey, in and of itself, doesn't have a top 10 Sonic. Alright, well, Zone good at this matchup from somewhere. Zone just good, in Yeah, general. I was just going to say, I, th I think Zone just fucking good. Yeah, Jackal is the name. All right, so Zone looking for... He was getting a little bit beat on a bunch of neutral exchanges there, and suddenly, you know, it just is back in this game. Ooh. But and that forward air is going to end immediately. I like that. Oh, the standing on the ledge? Yeah, I like, like that. Like teetering over, looking down. So we saw, like, you know how Tyra did the, the up tilt kind of deposit there? Zone just kind of hanging off the ledge, like, yeah, that's right. That's, you got hit. That's right, I did this. You got to do about it. Is all making this this uh not only the matchup but like the match it's like the match itself pretty easy. Sounds good. Sounds real good. Some really good combos coming through from Zone. Just all all with all with like fast falling fair would kind of combo it into uh, his side B. And he's just making sure he's keeping Ixus at bay. Yeah, I Ixus deciding to go to Battlefield so that he can live a little bit longer, I think. And he has a little bit more movement on the platforms. I think he feels like he could have played the first game on Battlefield better. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. I'm this, not this so is, sure. This is not the Ixus that we, we saw that took Tyra to game five. Oh, uh, maybe it is. Maybe Zone has been just that on today. I mean, the dude has run through everybody. This was not a light event by any means. Some of the best European talent in existence. Some of the best Chicago players. Tyra, one of the best in the world. You know, Dan, Big Mac, Panda Bear. These are not not bad players. Oh, oh wow. wow. Fast falling there into up, up smash. It's not going to close it out, unfortunately, because it's Battlefield, but... It's that little pop-up hit. Oh, Sonic's turn for an up smash. There we go. Last time he tried that, uh, Zone traded with a Nair. I haven't seen much of that either. I, I know Sonic's up smash is actually fairly fairly decent within itself. But let's see if Zone can rebuttal. Ooh, see if he can do it again, but really good DI coming in from Exus to avoid all that. Yeah, you gotta get a specific pop-up hit and they can't DI away, so it is harder to do than really I think. It. I think at this point Exus is trying to find like he's finally realized like, alright, I'm getting caught by not only up smash. Forward air and shadow ball. Those are the three things that I keep seeing, that I see that Zoan is just kind of what's allowing him to get these these leads, these combo starting starters. Well, if Ixus can close this out and we get a game four, he's very likely going to have to win on a much smaller stage, as that back throw would have killed anywhere else easily, especially that percentage. Zone having a difficult time closing out this particular stock. Something that Ixus needed a little bit. That was a weird looking like double air dodge. He's going for like this elongated weird like I'm going to air dodge into the oh. neutral air. Up throw yeah, into it, it. That up throw very very strong. No rage required. So here we go. Over there. Oh, let's, let's, can Ixus finish this off? 
because now you're giving Mewtwo rage. So you can't let him get any kind of a run on you. Zone, meanwhile, oh. with a no wow, up being onto the stage. That was gutsy. I don't even think X has, like, realized that was going to happen, so. Right, the little... Soft hit of Nair, keeping him at bay. Sonic Nair is good. Sonic Nair lingers for a long time. There's the neutral air. It's a fair. All right, Zone not really able to follow up with anything. He had the right idea to follow him. He's got to be careful, though. Just 135 is a lot of damage. Mm -hmm. Looking to send Ixus Looking to send Ixus home. He can put something together. Ixus needing to finish out the stock to stay alive in the tournament. Back throw? Will it kill? No. Now it's Zone's turn to take advantage of the large size of Battlefield. Mm -hmm. Honestly, Down Fair oh. side. Oh. oh my god. Oh, oh my god, zone. Jeez. What a little savage. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy thing yeah, is yeah. that I, I think zone can, can has like the tools. Oh. Oh. Now, he, he did have the tools. He had the right idea. That was such a cool idea. The side V into the second fair. Nice little elongated combo, but mm -hmm. Ix is able to pull it out. Um, sticking out the kind of keep away that last dog. Zone was really unable for a long time to get in there and make any of these things happen. Now we're getting a little bit of a crowd factoring in. Quick sitting there watching. Griffith there. The rest of the European oh, guys. Yeah, all the European guys are huddling together now. Well, Ixus is their last hope. And this little, like, mini America versus Europe kind of, like, side plot. I wonder how well Gluttony would have done this here. Gluttony's so good. Wario is a character, but Gluttony's a very good player. So... It's always it's always amusing to me that like some of these care some of these players that like are so known like say Gluttony you know very very good at his uh, Wario X is very good at his Sonic but like how well they'd be as if they were playing I wouldn't say more of a top tier top tier characters but just like put their time in like other characters that know that are known for having more success. Yeah, I mean you. Tier list is a real thing, but, you know, there's some characters that just... If you're the only representation for a character, there's probably a reason for that. Mm. Like, objectively, a character like Wario that Gluttony plays is not going to be as powerful as a character like Bayonetta or Cloud in right. the DLC. But, on the other hand, like, Waft can kill you at 10. Like, mm. so there's there's that. Aim for Lilat. I'm kind of surprised at the Lilat pick. I guess the up throw kill is still really early. They both Mewtwo, have her, uh, her uh, early back throw kills too, too. Mewtwo can do some really janky things with Lilac platforms, too. Sweet. Zone was the one who, who picked the stage. He did. Hmm. Maybe he's the, I, I feel like Sonic has issues with Lilac. It also gives him three platforms to up smash onto, but it's not really mattering because Ix is doing a great job of finishing off that stock from Zone and just... Once again, he's probably going to play keep away. Gets a couple of grabs. This is his third this is in a row. Third grab. Jeez. Are we going for four? Nah, he went for an aerial that time. Forward air not quite going to kill. Probably going to put on some damage and some pressure. Ooh. Oh, he caught him. He held it out there. You could see it the whole time. Just like Caught you said earlier, the, 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 just the trail itself is very hard to predict because, like, he had air dodge, but it still, like, wasn't enough. Ooh, fair, trading fares. Zone, like, just inches off of getting that back air to connect. If he would have hit Sonic in the mid stage with a back air, the sky was the limit. Depending on which platform he bounced onto. We haven't seen, like, a, another paralyzer attempt on, like, a platform or anything crazy. Or, I'm sorry, disable attempt. Disable. I gotta remember that. No. It's like a faux pas calling that move disable. Disable disables one move, not all of them. All right, Ixus unable to connect with these aerials. It is a this is a dangerous percentage spot here. I think more for Sonic than Mewtwo, to be honest. So needs to get a little bit more damage together unless he can get a little bit of contact with like a heavy back air. Zone with a little poke there, keeping the percentages fairly even. A little More bit more percentage off. Oh. Throws a shadow ball, why not? Zone's been really good at just catching everything that Ixus has been doing with Ooh. shadow ball. What is that? That's not gonna quite do it. He sat in shield for a long time. That oh! oh! 
All right, pop him with that tail. Knock him out of the bracket with that up air. I am shook. I am not feeling bad for Sonic, but hey, you know, that was a great reactive up air. And stage spike sort of thing. Uh, Ix has made the mistake of trying to go down a little bit too deep.